Hello! Um, it is the day after yesterday, the 12th of March. Uh, 2013, of course, otherwise it wouldn't look this young. <laughs> um, basically, this vlog, the first, I've just got to get this on my chest because this is bugging the fuck out of me now. Okay? There are certain people watching these videos that I've um, found out somehow, okay? Um, probably because I can see who watches the videos and where they're located. And, well, there's only certain people that I know that are from certain regions. Uh, so if it says, you know, St. Albans or something, okay? Or perhaps, I don't know. Let's say I knew the police were watching my videos because it was saying, Hi Wickham. Um, now, not a lot of views actually come from the UK. So if it says, Hi Wickham, and I, you know, I sort of know uh, that the police were watching them anyway. Fuck you. I'm not stupid. Uh, if anything, you guys should know, I'm a computer person. I would know. Uh, well, anyway, I found out that certain people were watching the videos. It's not just one person, it's multiple people, okay? Damn, I look like a mess. What the fuck is going on here? Anyway, the basic thing is, fuck off. These are for people, random people though, not you. I can't be dealing with having you silly fuckers watching my uh, my videos. Anyway, I've got to get that two seconds. That was pretty much a waste of time. It's a fucking energy company. Why do they ring in the office? Anyway. Oh, Avenge Sevenfold. Nice. Um, the basic point in this video, anyway, okay? The actual point, not just that little rant I just had. It was brought to my attention that my video yesterday, um, I may not be sticking to that necessarily. If that's the case, I'm very sorry. Uh, I happen to be having some small issues. Uh, I am going to see my GP or my doctor, whatever, uh, to hopefully get referred on to a psychiatric unit um, for assessment because I don't know what the fuck is wrong with me if any of you if any of you close people that are watching this apparently um, know Alex Mr. Alex Nachera little asshole. I'm almost as fucked up as him recently and that's that's pretty difficult trust me if you don't, I'll describe him very quickly. He was a short Italian cunt. I uh, don't like that word, but still, that's pretty much how uh, uh, he was, okay? He is a scam artist from the UK. Type his name into Google. Um, you'll find you'll find him. He was in magazines and papers, so was his dad and his, his fucking family. And they fucked off to Italy, so yeah. After scamming people in this country. Anyway, uh, I just thought I'd tell that to people because some of you probably don't know that. Uh, and he didn't respond to being called a bastard very well. So Alex, you're a bastard if you're watching this. Uh, anyway, moving swiftly onwards. Um, I don't even know what this vlog was about. What was it? Oh! Some tech news, I guess. Why not? Um, I've just watched a Galaxy S4 video. I'm very sceptical about these videos. Uh, it does look very real. The only difficulty being... I've never known a phone, even if it's pre-released, it would be so laggy. I mean, it was like this phone. I mean, not like this phone, but... Lagginess. I mean, like I'll unlock it. 
that was pretty instant. But like, if I go into the menu, see there's some delay. It was like that. And this phone is a Galaxy Ace. It is crap. Well, actually it's pretty good, but for basic tasks. Don't expect to be playing your Angry Birds on it. Uh, I don't even know what else to say, really. Uh, I have cookies, but none of you are here to share them with me. Oh, actually, I want to shout people out. Um, I have no idea whether they should be shouted out or not. But actually, well, like I say, I'm fucked in the head, I don't know. Um, some fantastic people in my life I'd like to shout out. Uh, so, obviously, you know who you are. Um, so there's Elena, uh, there's Jessica, and there's Harriet. Those three people mean a lot to me and I hope that they stay close to me no matter what really um, <laughs> um I can't believe I'm about to do this really actually no I'm not gonna do that don't worry um, on the guy front um, there's pretty much the stone wall oh and a friend of mine which I actually can't mention for legal reasons in fact um, he I can't mention him however those two people are lifesavers uh, Omar that does include your family as well because your family are just the best people they are pretty much my family like that's who I consider family now um, which is I've always had a strange way of doing things and well if I can't have my family I have Omar's <laughs> Um, oh, and an update on uh, the stuff that I'm not supposed to be talking about, but I'm going to anyway because I don't care, perhaps. I recently found out, because I've changed my name, the caution I signed for stuff that happened last year uh, is no longer valid. Which is fantastic, because it shouldn't have ever been administered. I found that out a while ago, but the recent thing was, because I signed with it in my old name, it's all in my old name, nothing can be done about it. For it to be uh, made to work for me now, I would have to sign it again, and I would refuse, because I now know that they were trying to be... Uh, sly little pricks. I think that's one way of describing uh, uh, what's it? Was it called? Th no, it's not. Thames Valley. They're the bastards, yeah. Thames Valley Police. Um, I'm not happy with you if you're watching this. You just... Pff, I'm sure I'm going to get a phone call now. Uh, you got you got to come to the police station because we're going to get you again. Bring it on. Because to be quite honest with you, any judge would look at this video and go, oh, you know what, actually, I'm siding with the police. But I've had enough. You stopped me in Chesham and Amersham and High Wycombe multiple times for no reason. Um, you made my life a fucking misery. I'm telling you, you stopped me from a couple of days of work. Uh, you dragged me from my family's home. It wasn't even my personal home. In fact, you did wake my mum up, but that's not the point. To come and arrest me. And when I said, fuck off, I'll come and see you in a bit, your response was, no, you have to do it now. There was no arrestable offence, so fuck you, all of you. Uh, I hope you all, uh, I don't know, catch fire or something. Um, or I hope someone throws a brick through your van or something. Uh, no, I don't intend on doing that, so don't come and arrest me for that. Um, oh, I also remember one of you guys um, trying to inspect my car. Um, and uh, try and find me, you know, try and find drugs or anything on my person. 
Uh, you, if you looked hard enough, you would have found them, but I don't do that anymore. I'm sensible. Uh, however, you guys still aren't because you're still carrying on. And I think that brings me on to the last subject, which is music. Uh, I absolutely adore music. Uh, recently changed my music style. I used to listen to just kind of like, um, I guess, average radio kind of stuff. So I don't know what else, what kind of stuff is on radio nowadays, but all the normal stuff you'd hear on the radio. Uh, and now I'm just jamming out to sort of Evanescence and Dead by April and all the kind of stuff that I probably should have known a while back. Uh, Fallout Boy, uh, Billy Talent, you know, Avril Lavigne, Avenged Sevenfold, Hollywood Undead, Breaking Benjamin, uh, All Time Low, you know, Cute is What We Aim For, that kind of stuff. And I don't know if that's what's made me depressed, but my God, is it emotional and I love that shit. That's what I've always wanted out of any kind of music. So, I'm glad I found you guys. I'm talking about music, of course, but you guys are fantastic as well. Um, oh, God, I really want to say something. I can't. If the police are watching this, okay, I want a phone call from you or a tweet or something, okay? Can I now talk about my case? Since it's now nothing to do with me, or am I now just have to forget it? I'm genuinely interested in that um, because I want to make a whole damn video about it that I'm I can say everything in um, just for the people out there that actually watch this because believe it or not you fuckers think it's funny but actually it's uh, somewhat quite good actually to vent sometimes on a video you should try it. Uh, rather than take the piss out of people like me that don't know anything about law and uh, don't give me uh, mandatory uh, phone calls and things like that uh, and then put me in a cell for a non-arrestable offence. Well done! I now have faith in the British legal system entirely. Sarcasm. Anyway, peace out. Uh, there will be another vlog perhaps tomorrow. I don't know. Otherwise, the next vlog's going to be on Saturday when I go and get home from the airport. 